Hey guys, it's Renee. Welcome back to my channel. So today I am going to be doing a Laura Mercier review. Um, I've heard a lot about this deep, I'm sorry, medium deep powder. And so I had to cop it. I went online to Sephora.com and I ordered it. And I just really want to try it for myself to see exactly how um, it works. So basically this is an all over translucent setting powder for your face. You can set your whole face with this. You can set your highlight with this. You can set your contour with it. Basically it's just for your whole face. Um, Laura Mercier made one for black women. So her white translucent powder and like banana-ish color translucent powder is really, really popular. But um, I'm just excited to see what this one looks like. So this is translucent medium deep. Like I said, it's from Laura Mercier and she just released this a few weeks ago, maybe about a month ago actually. I'm not sure, but I just got my hands on it. It came in my Sephora box. So this little, this little thing came in this big old box. So I just got finished doing my whole face um, and actually my makeup is starting kind of to sweat a little bit. So I need to hurry up and set it. So what I'm gonna do is I took, I went ahead and took the clear, oh gosh. There was a little clear um, stopper on here. But what I'm gonna do is I don't know if you guys can see that. You can see some of the powder right there. I'm gonna pour a little bit into the cap. Not too much, I think that's enough. I have already damped my beauty blender. This is what I actually use to put my makeup on with, so you can kind of see it's already dirty, I guess. So I poured a little bit into the cap. I'm gonna use my mirror right here. And I am going to dip my beauty blender in this. Not a whole lot, just enough. And so guys, if you want to avoid flashback, it's best to press this into your skin with a damp beauty blender. It just really helps to, um, like I said, avoid flashback. You can put it on with the brush, but this is the best way to do it. So I'm going to start by pressing this into my skin. And I want to press it in there good. I don't want to like leave anything on there. Ooh. So that's this side. And I haven't done this side yet. You can kind of see it matted this side up a little bit. Yeah. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and press this in all over my skin and then I'll come right back. I'm gonna try not to put too much over my highlight. I've already set my, my highlight and contour. I'll put a little bit over it, but I don't wanna put too much over it because I don't want to dull down my highlight. Cause you know you gotta be bright like the sun, girl. Everywhere you go, you gotta shine. Like Beyonce said. Shine, shine. Thought I had a smell to it. It doesn't. Okay, mat me up, Laura. Just putting a little bit in there. All right, so I think I've kind of put it in there enough. To make sure, I can't be out here sweating. And let me see. I actually like what it did. It's just like a subtle matte, like just finish, if that makes any sense. I thought it was gonna give me more so of a bronze, like warmer look, but it didn't. Um, but I guess it just does its job. It's basically just a translucent powder just with the brown finish on it, if that makes any sense. I really don't like white translucent powders anyway, so it just did its job. I think I like it. So I think what I'm gonna do, actually next time, I, I set it after I did my makeup just for the sake of this video because I didn't wanna have to finish my makeup on camera. But what I'm gonna do is after I finish my foundation, I'm gonna go ahead and set it with the Laura Mercier and try that out for a few weeks and then finish my makeup and see how it goes. Cause I don't like putting setting powder, colored setting powder anyway, on top of my highlight because I just feel like it just changes the color of it kinda. But it did its job, I like it thus far. So this is just my first impression guys. Of course, I'm going to keep trying this out. I'm gonna do a few tutorials with it and kinda just see how it turns out. But if you're thinking about getting it, I say give it a try. Um, and just see if it works for you. Like I said, it definitely did its job, for sure. I was actually starting to sweat before I did this video, but it's um, much better now. So yeah, I'll be back with like a follow-up. 
Thanks for watching, y'all.